witnessing here, senators, is the return of an ancient and forgotten super species. Godzilla, the Mutos, Kong. We believe that these titans and others like them provide an essential balance to our world. And while some may pose a threat, Monarch is uniquely prepared to determine which of these titans are here to threaten us and which of these titans are here to protect us. Thank you for the fifth grade history lesson, Mr. Coleman. But we still haven't heard one good reason why monarchs shouldn't fall under military jurisdiction or why these creatures shouldn't be exterminated. Monarch was tasked with finding and destroying these radioactive monsters. But you either can't or won't tell us how many there are or why they're showing up. So maybe it's time for the military to put them down. Killing them would be a mistake. They returned because of us. It was our atomic testing that awoke Godzilla. Other creatures like the Mutos from strip mining and seismic surveys. But these are not monsters. They are animals rising to reclaim a world that was once theirs. It almost sounds like you're protecting them, Dr. Sirizawa, as if you admire them. I admire all forms of life. Senators, if we hope to survive, we must find ways to coexist with Titans, with Godzilla. A sort of symbiotic relationship, if you will. Like the lion and the mouse. Or the scorpion and the frog. So you'd want to make Godzilla our pet? No. We would be his. Okay, we've zeroed in on the last thing from New York. Fenway Park, get ahead. Okay, guys, we need to find the Orca, get Madison, and get the hell out of there. Go, go, go! We'll lay cover fire to keep the door distracted. <laughs> 